Do you play Wrath beta? I'm not in the beta, actually. Uh, I was. I've been checking. I don't really want to play Wrath beta, so I'm not really um, that interested in like playing. But I'm so curious if I'm going to get in. You know, just out of sheer curiosity. Yeah. See, I'm not even in. I assume I would see it here, right? Fell off. They've never given me beta. They didn't even give me BC beta the day it came out. Did you sign up? I've never had to. Um, or I guess I I never felt like I needed to uh, in the position that I was in. But mm. they've never given me any type of... I never got classic beta until I begged for it. I never got Overwatch beta. In fact, Overwatch, a long... Not Overwatch 2. We're talking like first Overwatch. A long, long time ago when I was like one of the biggest streamers on Twitch, period. Um not only that, the biggest WoW streamer, right? Asmongold didn't even exist yet as a streamer. Um, yeah, they never, go, never gave me Overwatch access either. And I had a couple of friends at Blizzard I was messaging, and this was crazy to me. And this is why I still think someone at Blizzard f***ing hates me. Personal vendetta against me. Um, mm. they, they didn't get me in the first week, which was like, ah, oh, that sucks. But then the next week or next wave, I messaged a friend and said, "Hey, all right, you're on the list. You're getting you're getting in the next Overwatch. I, you're on the list." I personally handed it, and I messaged like five people, and they all confirmed I was there. Next wave, someone took my name off the list. I was not in the next wave, so I messaged the same person again. I said, "Hey, I'm not in." He's like, "What?" He went in, and he added it again. I wasn't in the third wave either. Apparently, someone removed me again. I was getting removed. Personally, name taken out. That's the only possible explanation, um, which is crazy. Fifth wave, Andy. Yeah, I, I just didn't. I didn't get in. Period. I never. Well, fifth wave, but by then I didn't want to play anymore. Mm. Or they lied to you. So yeah, five people could have lied to me. I messaged. I mean, I, I don't. I, I'm not gonna say names, but like three f***ing people that I personally knew. And hung out with in real life before. Mm. And some other people, too. I just don't want to say names. A long time ago... Okay, how about this? A long time ago... Um, and this is when I was much younger. Mm. Um, I got a sponsorship opportunity to play... And this is how long ago this was. The new Crusader class in Diablo 3. I don't know if y'all remember how long ago mm. that class was added to Diablo. Long fucking time ago. It was actually my first ever sponsored opportunity. Nick was my manager, mm. for example. Um, I'm living in Michigan at the time. I'm like 19 years old. And they're not even paying that much. I'm just excited. Like, oh, sh And all they wanted was a YouTube video of playing and showing off the Crusader class. Now, this management company that I guess was going out trying to hire people to show off the Crusader class hired me and Nick to do a little video. And I did it. And then the day to release the video came up, and then that management company said, hey, Blizzard really doesn't like you. Mm. Um, and we f***ed up. We're sorry. Um, they don't want to have you do the video. But we already had you make it, and we already told you we'd pay you, so here's what we'll do. We'll give you half the money to not release it. And, that, and if you do release it, you get nothing. So... Yeah, mm. I do personally feel like someone at Blizzard really doesn't like me. That's what happens. Yeah, they didn't want to endorse me. To be fair, back then, I deserved it. Uh, I know the brand risk meme is like a big thing for me like nowadays, but back then, I was bad. There's, no, there's nothing else to it. I was really, really, really bad. I told you my dad worked at Blizzard. Whoa. Mm.